Progress now being made in the bid to rename military bases named after Confederate generals. Recent racial tensions across the country forced the U.S. to re-examine the legacy of some historical figures, giving rise to a growing call to rename military bases that bear the name of Confederate generals. Earlier this week, President Trump forcefully shooting down that idea, writing that the bases have become, quote, part of a great American heritage. But the Republican-led Senate Armed Services Committee breaking with the president, voting to require the renaming of the bases. If you want to continue naming forts after soldiers, there have been a lot of great soldiers that have come along since the Civil War. Well, I think this is a step in the right direction. This is the right time for it. Tennessee Republican Senator Lamar Alexander also signaling that he is open to the idea of renaming the bases, saying, quote, I think it's always appropriate to review the people and places that we honor to see if they fit the context of the times in which we live.